Hi there guys! Have you ever encountered the Final Cut Pro red screen of death? Well, these are some ways on how to fix it. The first one, I'm gonna state the obvious, try and restart your computer. Okay, you bought a plugin and it might be that you've installed it in the wrong folder. So let's dive into the computer and I'll show you where these should be. Okay, so you open the finder. Well, I've already here, but you go to movies, motion templates, and here you'll see, for example, my titles. I have here an adjustment layer. I'll go into the long one. I'll go onto the plugin and I'll press Command I, and you'll be able to see here that it's a the extension is M O T I. So this stands for motion title. So if this plugin was in the generators folder, this wouldn't work. So you would have to move it to the titles folder. Okay, so an MOEF file should be in the effects folder. An MOTN file should be in the generator folder. The, MOR, uh, the MOTI should be in the title folder and the MOTR should be in the transition folder. So make sure these are all located in the right folders. Still no plugin worky worky? <laughs> So let's try the following thing. These folders should have an extension of .localized. Let's have a look. I'm gonna go to the motion templates root folder, click on it, press command I, and check that this has here a .localized extension on it. If so, you can close it. If not, add it to the end. And for the following, you need to do the same for the effects, generators, and titles. Check that the effects has a dot localized extension, generators and titles and so on. And if it doesn't, just add it and let's see if your plugins now work. Still no luck? Well, this might be because your plugin is newer than your Final Cut Pro version. What you can do is open the App Store and look for it. Final Cut. And if you have here the update option, then update it. Let's see if once it's updated, you can use your plugins. If for some reason you can't update your Final Cut Pro, you can backdate your plugins. Before this used to be a really pain in the buttocks process, which involved a lot of uh, opening files and changing some uh, data. But now there is a backdater. So let's have a look. I have a link in the description so you can open this. So click on the link and you'll see here at the bottom that you can upload a file or in this case your plugin. You can backdate it to the version of your Final Cut Pro and upload the file. Once you've uploaded it, it will do its magic. You'll be able to download it and you can place it back to the original folder where it was. And this time I hope it works. If not, we can try two more things. Before, this used to be a really annoying process. You had to find the files, open them in a text editor, look for some lines of code and change some of the versions. And now you have this. Okay, second to last thing. Let's trash your Final Cut preferences. To do so, you go on to your Final Cut Pro icon here at the bottom. You press Command, Option and click. And you'll see here it comes with delete preferences. You click on that and it will delete your preferences. This might be a little inconvenient because it will delete all your preferences that you saved in Final Cut Pro as well. So you might have to go back in there and readjust them or add the preferences you had before. Still no luck. Let's try something with the disk utility. For this, press command and space. Look for disk, utility, press enter. Go on to your hard drive. This is taking a while, what's going on? Oh, there you go. Go into your hard drive, click on first aid and click on run. This will stop your computer for a while. It will do some checks, see if the preferences are okay, if the folder structures are all okay and hopefully this will fix the plugging <laughs> problem. 
If not, throw away the plugin, throw away your computer, and sorry, I can't help you anymore. <laughs> I really do hope that one of these ways fixed your plugin problem. That was it from my side. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Take care, bye bye.